Hi, I'm Sheila Long O'Mara, Executive Editor with Furniture Today. Welcome to our Las Vegas News Desk, This Market, January 2024. I'm happy to introduce you to Mark Deninder, who is the Interim CEO and Chairman of Serta Simmons Betting. Hey, Mark. Thanks, Sheila. Nice to be here. Thanks for joining us. I know it's kind of crazy busy. Starting to. Starting to. Yes, sir. Um, so I was in Doraville with you guys a couple weeks ago leading into market. A lot of things are going on with the company. The industry is wondering what's ahead for Serta Simmons. You guys emerged from Chapter 11 last market six months ago. So kind of give us an update on where the company is and how you're tracking with your overall strategy. Well, thanks. Uh, we've we put a detailed turnaround plan in place in July when we emerged from bankruptcy and we're making really really strong progress on that plan. Um, we're coming into Vegas this week with a very strong product line um, that we've worked on. It's an accelerated product development uh, process but we've got seven new lines across both brands and we've done a really nice job of distinguishing between Beauty Rest and Serta and we have five new lines on the Serta side, two new lines on the Beauty Rest side, all of which have come together uh, really quickly uh, by our product development team. Um, probably the most important thing that's happened in the company in the last six months is the team has really come together. We, you know, we had a, a core group of people at the company. We've, as you have seen, we brought back some people with industry experience and that's really facilitated the acceleration of the product development side. So it's, it's, it's the team working together. They've done a great job and the product looks great. It feels great. It's differentiated uh, between the two brands. And we think we're gonna speak, we're gonna lead with product and, and people are gonna see that. So there's a lot of product up in your showroom. 56 new mattress models. That's a lot of product. Tell me what the thinking was with that large breadth of goods here at this market. So it was very strategic in what we were introducing. It's not just a lot of product, it's actually very targeted to, to making sure that the two brands have a full line offering from value price points sub $5.99 and both brands have new offerings at the low end to the, to the luxury segment, to the premium segment. And then on the Serta side especially, we've really tried to extend the Perfect Sleeper franchise and now we've got some new product on the Perfect Sleeper Hybrid which is a, uh, a mattress that has a model that has both uh, foam and coil. And then at the high end, we're introducing a latex product, so it's called the Perfect Sleeper Pro. And then what we're probably uh, most excited about is the relaunch of iComfort, which has been, uh, a, uh, uh, it's always been a star inside the portfolio, but it's, it has not grown. And we, uh, we've relaunched iComfort with a whole new product uh, and then we've got uh, an iComfort Pro line, which also has latex in it, that we're super excited about. Yeah, and the iComfort Pro has a lot of latex in it, it right? Um, you have step-up models that go all the way up to your top. The whole strategy, Sheila, as you saw, is built on the step-up story and making sure that it's very easy for the RSA and the retailer to sell our product. So each level, as you go up, has more value in it, and it's very clear what's in it and how they can sell it to get people to go to higher price points. Very cool. So what are you um, most excited about market here? What do you expect to take away from your week here in Vegas? We've sent a real clear message to the market coming out of bankruptcy that we're focused on our retail partners. And today we have, we have over 300 appointments booked and we had a lot, that's added to in the last couple of days. I just spent my morning with two of our largest customers. Um, people want to see what we're doing and they're going to be impressed. And so I think the, the affirmation that the product is strong from our retail customers is what we're going to be, what I'm looking for. Um, and then we, we're going to have the, the, the challenge of the phasing of the rollout of the new product introduction. But I, I think, um, you know, we, we did speak to, we, we spoke to the market, we spoke to our licensees. There's a lot of research going into what we're launching. It's well thought out and uh, we're, we're feeling really good about the new line. Very cool. So we'll have to touch base after market Absolutely. and see if everything came to fruition the way you see it in your mind. Right? Yeah, exactly. All right. Very cool. I think we're out of time. Again, thanks for tuning in. I'm Sheila Long O'Mara and I've been speaking with Mark Denender from Serta Simmons Betting.